this is the energy vibration reading for the scorpion sun moon and rising this is the month of July and I want to say welcome um thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for your likes and share welcome or new scorpion now this month is dedicated to a fellow Capricorn um, that has supported her channel because she would like to have these um, general readings going um, her name is Sadie so we're dedicating this month's for Sadie and I'm asking you guys to say thank you for Sadie she has supported our channel so that um, we can keep these reading going okay because these are general readings for a, a personal reading always um, connect with the link um, below this video and um, please like and subscribe leave your message okay she have donated a, um, a lot of cards a lot of decks for us um, whatever decks that I'll be using in the future most of them is coming from her um, uh, we want to say thank you to Sadie and we want to wish her all the luck in the world and um, I love this deck this is um, the energy of her basically I love the simplicity so clear so uh, pure and this is a positive deck thanks again Sadie so um, this month is the month of um, the hair offense so this is the month of working out a lot of karmatic situation with a lot of people okay um, the two first weeks in this month is going to be good for you guys because this is uh, the energy of the zodiac energy of water the two last week is going to be um, the energy of fire okay so let's see for you scorpions what is going to be transpiring you guys have the energy of the eye princess so a lot of um, information is going to be coming to you um, from via your spirit guides and your soulmate via your spirit guides and your soulmate a lot of energy a lot of positive energy a lot of new things a lot of positive information is going to be coming in via um, your um, intuition and your guiding angels okay so um, if you don't believe in guiding angels just think of your intuition and your higher self your mighty I am present self so um, this month I would advise people to call upon their mighty I am present self to awaken their divine blueprint okay so let's see what is coming in for you um, scorpion because the month is four weeks and um, please go and listen to the general energies it is very important to listen to the general energies for all you scorpion very very important to listen to the general energies so for the scorpion sun moon and rising sign we're calling up in the angels to show us what will be the energy for the first week for the first week you have the energy of the king of swords okay whoever this person is whoever this king of swords is is coming in in the first um, the first week who is this king of swords we're going to be looking at this king of swords it could be your father or it could be a spirit guide that is coming in who um, is using the energy of swords okay um, the general um, energies for the first week is the energy of justice okay and the energy of justice have the energy of this a king of swords okay so be aware of what is happening in the first week of July with justice and injustice and that sort of thing second week of July there come an end to this king of swords wonderful energy because it's as if as you, some of you have been dealing with this king of swords for a very very long time it's as if this person was harassing you for whatever reason it was it was as if this person was just in your life this could be a relationship um, um, that some of you ladies was married to this person and you decided to end this marriage because the first week um, is the energy of justice and he came out so it could be that some of you ladies this was your ex-husband and it finally ended your divorce finally ended in the second week okay for some of you this could be your father um, and I don't know but a lot of situations are happening where I'm seeing um, you know parents who was abusing their kids that justice is going to come for them it's as if uh, um, justice is as if they're now found out um, justice is going to come for them 
Um, this could be a situation um, where some of you have been dealing with this man, whether he's your boss, your supervisor, or whatever. But this, it's coming to an end. Um, the devil, the energy of the devil, comes up in the third week, and it has to do with your work. Um, uh, the third week, the energy of the devil comes up. It has to do with your work. We're going to be looking at that to see what is going to be happening, okay? And let's see what the angels have for you guys in the fourth week. In the fourth week, fourth week. Oh, <laughs> okay. You guys deserve this ending. You guys deserve this ending because a positive new beginning is going to be coming up for you. You guys really, really, really deserve this ending because a, a very positive new beginning is going to be coming up for you guys. And this is just going to be so fabulous, so um, so wonderful. Okay, so what we're receiving here, and it's um, you know, the energy of death, the devil, and the world. So, okay, let's look at the situation. Okay, um, there is obviously a situation that some of you have been dealing with someone, a man who is a, a um, Aquarian, a Gemini, or a Libra. You have been dealing with this man for a very long time, or a situation that has a horrible situation. In the second week finally finally you have the energy of the Pisces who are going to be helping you to end the situation with this man the ending is with the devil It's as if you have gotten yourself in some peddly with this man because obviously here air and uh, uh, water and hair sign don't mess whoever this man is he was um, having a, a situation in your life and now the energy of the world comes out okay here we're going to see what was the situation between justice a <gasps> temperance temperance but for some people is justice as is, is, um, for some people is the end see the scale um, and 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 um, it's as if this is justice in the spirit world just as justice because temperance is balance and this is justice in the spirit world and in the first week going on to the second week especially the first week is the energy of judgment in the general energies go and listen to the energy vibration reading for the general energies so finally a situation that you have been dealing with someone who is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra is finally finally over out out okay then as we look at it, the situation with the debt and the devil the energy of debt and the devil what is the energy of debt and the devil the energy of debt and the devil the Empress comes in to resolve the situation the Empress came in to resolve the situation so the energy of debt and the devil what happened is that whatever you were um, dealing with with this person um, the energy um, of debt and the devil is the end of a situation and someone who is a Capricorn came in to help you resolve the situation and bring balance to the situation okay someone who is a Capricorn because um, here you or someone who's a Capricorn came in to help you and the energy of the Capricorns are coming up also in the fourth week because obviously um, the, the world is the, carries the energy vibration of the Capricorns and they and the Empress carries the in the, uh, the energy vibration of a Capricorn now um, the Virgos the the temperance is the energy of the Virgos but this can also be um, the energy of um, balance in the spirits the guides and angels are balancing out a situation okay so um, let's look and see what is happening for the devil and the world the devil and the world but we all know what is happening the seven of swords the seven of swords the devil and the world the seven of swords so 
devil in the world is the end of a situation the end of a, but someone is trying to get away with something so let's see what is going to be happening here let's see because there this month of July is going to be really 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 a month of um, a lot of changes endings of situation that was holding you um, at bay okay ending of situation that was all in your bay. temperance and the emperance temperance and the emperance what is the uh, working together okay so you are going to be working together and the um obviously the ascendance masters are here so you um, scorpions are going to be working with the ascendance masters in this month of July because they're coming in to resolve situations number 33 is here in the middle of your reading then we have the world which is 21 which is three so you're working with the ascendance masters okay you're working with the ascendance masters okay let's see what else is going on what else is going on for the Empress and the seven of swords Empress nine of pen the eight of Pentacles okay the Empress and the seven of swords is working um, extremely hard okay and three and eight is eleven there is money that is going to be coming in okay there is basically money that is going to be coming in so whatever that um, what whatever justice and legal situation that you had to do with someone who was an um, a king of swords who was an Aries, um, an Aries, um, uh, a Gemini over a Libra, that is coming to an end, and justice is going to be coming in. Let's see the outcomes of the month for you guys. The outcomes is a Three of Cups, a celebration, happiness. You have finally end a disruptive situation that was in your life. So. Um, whatever this disruptive situation was because sometimes we are not aware of certain energies that is coming out but whoever this king of swords was and this page of ones this page of ones page of ones page of ones is um, some of you have a child um, some of you have a child that is an some of you have a child that is an um Aries Leo or Sagittarius and something was stolen this person could have stolen something let's see what is the seven of swords seven of swords is someone trying to get away with something okay so the page of ones is someone who is a uh, and uh, Aries Leo or Sagittarius and she's trying to get away with something let's see what she's trying to get away with nine of ones you're protected from this person okay so not to worry about five of ones a conflicts she's trying to get away with something whoever um, she is yeah this page of ones is trying to get away with something um, some conflicts and situation but stay away from this person whoever this person is stay away from this person okay just stay away from this person there is going to be a good outcomes that is coming in there is going to be a positive good outcomes okay so your month in the first week you're finally going to end a situation a karmatic situation between you acquire an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra you're going to be working together number threes is so much one two three four times the number three is here 33 and 33 is the uh, is the energy vibration of the ascendance master so I'm calling in all the ascendance masters to come in and bless this reading to help each and every person that is going to listen to this reading to uh, uh, um, awaken their um, divine blueprint because the ascendance masters are here so we're calling upon the ascendance masters to show us the mirror reading of this reading because obviously there is something the outcomes is the three of cups and um, the center of your month is around your materialistic possession the center of the month is around your materialistic possession but the center of the month is around the Empress who is a Capricorn okay the Empress is a Capricorn okay so um, the Empress is a Capricorn and trust me um, whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring some of you are going to be dealing with the page of ones and she could be trying to get away with something but you know it's gonna work out that you're going to see what she's trying to do you're going to see what she's trying to do okay so let's see what is the mirror side of this reading because um, 
the second week um, the second week of the you could be realizing that your um, your financial situation is being deplete but um, you're working hard but it's going to be okay okay you're going to be rebuilding um, the third week um, the energy of the devil with uh, um, um, it can be your you're trying to um, you're working against someone don't do it don't do it don't do it because um, it could be your work situation that in um, the third week a situation with your work be careful what you do at your work in the third week okay if you are about to accept a contract be careful what you're signing your life away to okay um, energy of the world comes up I end in I end in to um, a disrupt the situation that has been in your life for some time okay let's see what is happening in the mirror reading for you there was blockages and the blockages that was set is uh, um, blockages from the king of ones and these blockages are now ending okay these blockages in the first week are now being ended and you're going to receive a new start so it could be um, a, a young man or a young woman out there has been blocked by this person your father or um, someone at work or someone that you had a business situation with that has blocked you totally and now a new start is going to be coming in in the 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 um, second week and third week um second and third week you're seeing this and this peace coming in and whatever that was stolen this the, the theft that has been done is now going to be regained there is a new start but there is jealousy there's a lot of jealousy a lot of jealousy be aware of what is happening and because you're the last sign I'm gonna do something as a bonus let's look at the third week what is happening news is going to be coming in in the third week um, news is going to be coming in in the third week um, and this could be um, about financial situation um, this news and um, whatever the jealousy is and was about is going to come to an end so whatever the jealousy that was is and about is going to come to an end information is going to be coming in the fourth week and ending is going to be coming and you guys got the bonus hit because um, you guys are always the last sign and you guys never always get ah luck 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 isn't that wonderful and change is coming in your outcomes for you men is going to be wonderful some of you men are going to be connecting and the star okay so um, you men um, the outcomes is positive because the outcomes is going to be positive the energy of the star is here so it's as if in this month your the universal angels and guides are basically working with you to resolve situation because the energy of temperance comes in and that is when the spirit world is working behind the veils to resolve situations for you guys and this is what is happening um wonderful outcomes the the fourth week you have the energy of the world and um, there's um, positive news and information if you're about to publish a book or that sort of a thing do it in the first um, the fourth week in the fourth week because what is happening basically in the first week is that all the blockages are coming to an end and you're about to have a new start this new start is going to bring some peace in your life and whatever the, the, the um, this the uh, deception and indecisiveness is now coming to an end there was a lot of jealousy and hate there are news coming in news of a new start and whatever the jealous and um, jealousy that was happening this is coming to an end whatever blockage and the theft that has um, happened this is coming to an end 
which is basically um, so um, wonderful what is also coming in in the and in, in the fourth week for uh, the second week all the jealousy and the power struggle is now you're going to be receiving information about that you're going to be receiving information about all the jealousy and the power struggle that was um, going on here um, as we look at this um, this week which is, is just so beautiful you're seeing that information um, luck is going to be coming in and a positive um, new transition is going to be happening and this is in a very very positive way so let's look at um, the energy vibration of what is coming in let's look at the energy vibration of what is coming in for you guys let's look at the energy vibration of what is coming in for you guys oh my god it's an healing i can i, I know that as i see it it's an healing it's an healing it's an healing um yeah unconventionality your unique qualities are an important part of your life pur purpose it's okay to feel and to be different from others so isn't this wonderful yes it is it is okay um, your own conventionality your un is your unique qualities um, are an important a part of your um, life purpose it is okay to feel and be different from others and this is good okay so this is wonderful because um, whatever that has been happening whatever that has been transpiring there's a positive outcomes and you are being protected from whatever is coming at you whatever the sit um, indecisiveness whatever lies I'm seeing all of that working out in um, the first week going in the second week we have an end of a transition there was a lot of hate jealousy and that sort of a thing but that is coming to an end okay so wonderful positive energies are coming in I want to wish you a beautiful beautiful um, month of you July please remember to listen to the Sun moon and rising sign and the general energies you need to go back and listen to the general energies because there's a lot of information in the general energy but also in the third quarter so the third quarter is the month of July August and September so you'll be aligned with the energies what to expect in these three quarters namaste until next month